Hi all, in this video we are going to discuss Platform 3, Assessing the Need and Planning Care. The new NMC CBT Test of Competence Proficiencies explained in this video will help each newly registered nurse to acquire essential skills and knowledge to perform in their role in assessing and planning person-centered care for their patients. Each registered nurse in the UK prioritizes the individual needs of the patient whom they assess considering their spiritual, mental, emotional, social, physical, psychological, and behavioral needs. Nurses use these assessment findings to develop person-centered and evidence-based nursing care for the patients under their care. Furthermore, each nurse works in partnership with other disciplines to develop person-centered care considering individual preferences and circumstances. During your new NMC CBT exam, you will be getting questions assessing your clinical and theoretical expertise in relation to the following. 1. Your ability to apply the understanding of human development from the time of conceiving till the time of dying and to exhibit the clinical skills of person-centered assessment while planning developing care for individual patients. 2. Your ability to apply the knowledge of human anatomy and physiology, biology, genomics, body systems and homeostasis, pharmacology, social and behavioral sciences while completing person-centered assessment to complete the individual care plans. 3. Your ability to demonstrate an understanding of most frequently faced mental, physical, behavioral and cognitive health conditions, medication use and treatments when completing individual assessment to prioritize and develop person-centered care plans. 4. Your skills and knowledge to apply person-centered approach to nursing care, as well as demonstrating shared assessment, planning, decision-making and goal-setting while working with people of all ages, their families and communities. 5. Your ability to process all gathered information, to identify individual needs, and to develop evidence-based person-centered plans of care with a set of agreed goals. 6. Your ability and skills to assess the individual patient's decision-making capacity, with regards to their care. It can be either to consent or to withhold. 7. Your skills to understand and to apply the principles of reasonable adjustments to individual patient care where applicable. 8. Your knowledge to apply relevant laws about mental capacity applicable to the country in which you are practicing when making decisions for patients who do not have decision-making capacity. 9. Your ability to assess patients who are at risk, situations that may put them at risk, identifying safeguarding concerns and ensuring prompt action according to the situation. 10. Your skill to understand and to assess the individuals who are at risk of self-harm and with suicidal thoughts. 11. Your ability to perform investigations relevant to the situation, interpreting findings and sharing it with the relevant disciplines as significant. 12. Your ability to initiate interventions appropriate to the situation based on the investigation findings, requesting additional investigations appropriate to the condition and escalating the situations for further management. 13. Your ability to assess and understand the comorbidities and the need to meet complex nursing and social care needs of patients while prioritizing care for patients. 14. Your ability to assess the individual and family's needs at the end of life, needs for palliative care and decision-making related to care preference and their treatment. 15. Your ability to work in partnership with patients, families and carers and to monitor and evaluate the effectiveness of nursing care provided, sharing decision-making and readjusting agreed goals, documenting the decisions made and the progress observed. 16. Your ability to refer patients to other professionals safely and appropriately for further clinical interventions and support as needed. For you to explore the new version of the UK NMC CBT exam and to practice, or to prepare for the exam, you could visit our sample online course in the first link on the description. If you find this section useful, please like it and share with your friends. More NMC CBT related subjects will be uploaded in the coming days. To get the notification, consider subscribing our channel. Visit our YouTube channel for more clear-cut medical subjects. Thanks for watching.